हेलो फ्रेंड्स थैंक यू सो मच फॉर गेटिंग मी टू फाइव थाउजेंड सब्सक्राइबर्स इट हैज़ बीन एन अमेजिंग जर्नी सो फार एंड आई कॉन्ट वेट टू सी वर द फ्यूचर होल्ड्स फॉर मी थैंक यू सो मच फॉर ऑल दिस सपोर्ट नाउ इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू हाउ टू एड अ करेक्टर काउंटर टू टेक्स एंड पुट लेआउट इन माई प्रीवियस वीडियो आई शोड यू हाउ टू यूज टेक्स एंड पुट लेआउट इन स्केच वेयर आई ऑल्सो क्रिएटेड अ ब्लॉग पोस्ट रिगार्डिंग दिस टेक्स एंड पुट ले आउट इन स्केच वेयर नाउ इन दिस वीडियो आई विल यूज द सेम blog post to create similar text input layout so the first thing which which we have to do is switch on app compat and design here i have already switched on app compat and design and i have added these two linears linear 1 and linear 2 now in my previous video i had linear 2 and linear 3 whereas in this one i have linear 1 and linear 2 now after this i declared these two edit text fields edit text 1 and edit text 2 for this i have created a more block extra and i will just paste this in an add so strictly block in this more block this is a more block now in on create event i will define edit text 1 this is edit text 1 i define it as a new edit text with width match parent height wrap content and hint email then i define edit text 2 with width match parent height wrap content input type password and hint password this is edit text 2 After this, I define two text input layout: text input one and text input two, and add edit text one and edit text two to them. So this is code for text input one. This text input one. It is a text input layout with width match parent, height wrap content. and i added edit text 1 to this text input 1 and then i added text input 1 to linear 1 here i have linear 1 and linear 2 so i will add text input 1 to linear 1 similarly for text input 2 i create a new text input to i add edit text to to text input to and then i add text input to to linear 2 so here instead of linear 3 i will add it to linear 2 okay this will create text input fields which i created in my previous video but here in this video i will show you how to create text input field with a character count here you can see this zero is the character count which is displayed at the end of the edit text field just below it so in this video i will just show you how to add this kind of character counter in order to add this character counter we have to go to this text input 1 copy this text input 1 and then add character counter you only have to write text input 1 dot set counter enabled true set counter enabled true and that's all this is enough for creating a character counter which i just showed you now if you have to set maximum for this counter then you have to copy this part and here you have to write text input dot set counter max length and in brackets you can write the maps maximum length which you want to allow for this characters for this edit text field so here suppose i write 10 if i 
want to allow only 10 characters in this edit text field like a username then I have to write text input 1 dot set counter max length 10 and that's all now let's check this Okay, so here you can see that maximum characters are 10 and as we enter characters it shows the character count and after 10 characters it the line below becomes pink and the hint which becomes a text field text view that also becomes pink. So in this way we can add a character max length or counter max length 